Yeah, the, this is a 95 Chevy hearse. The guy um, had me cut the back off and make it into an El Camino, or I think, I think we should call it a crew Camino because it's a, uh, it's a crew cab, <laughs> but the, being it's a four-door, most El Caminos are two doors. Well, this thing is pretty cool. It, uh, it's got, um, uh, they had to lengthen the frame 15 inches to make it into a hearse. So it'd be long enough for, like I say, a hearse. And they, back in 95, they took a brand new Chevy Capri four-door, uh, not a station wagon, and they cut the cut it off right behind the front doors, and they and it's all custom made behind the front doors and of course the top. That's why we glad. Well, from the front doors, well, these are the back doors. These here, uh, these are custom made, but they're steel. But this is all fiberglass. That's fiberglass. The roof, the roof. That's fiberglass. Um, the thing is really kind of cool, but. Uh, it's been a lot of work and oh it comes to about maybe I'll make five bucks an hour working on this thing but it uh it wouldn't have took so much time but you have to uh figure it out as you go and, and um but you can see what I did. I I I uh I, I chopped off the back door and this is this is the bottom half of the back door here. And then that's the top half of it and then I, I made panels and I, I decided that so much of this is fiberglass, and then the floor in here is wood. A little, <laughs> little oil pan effect there, but or oil can effect, I guess. But uh, being the floor is made out of wood, um, and the sides here, these are this is fiberglass. I decided to just put the screws in and leave the screws sticking out, and then, and then uh, paint over the screws because it's. Because you really can't fasten steel to fiberglass very good. And so it's got exposed screws all over it, which, I don't know, I think it's kind of cool. It kind of gives it a kind of, maybe a little bit more of a rough look. But I decided to put the chrome back on here too, but it's got a rubber or a plastic strip that goes through here. Well, I kind of, I don't know if with the, being I put these screws in here, I think it had rivets at one time. And I don't know if you can get the plastic back in there again that covers the middle of this. But I guess the, the guy the guy that owns this thing, he's kind of handy, so maybe he'll be able to figure that out. Um, yeah, other than that, uh, my video is getting kind of long, so I suppose I should shut up. <laughs> but, uh, uh, yeah, that, that right there, that's, that's the panel that I, I cut off the roof. You can see the kittens running around here. One of them right there. And there's another cat right there. But um, yeah, that's that's what I cut off the top. And um, yeah, big big job. But um, anyway, that's about it.